the deal is done and I am the proud new owner of a 2018 Ford Mustang GT. What is up, fam? Hope this message finds you all well in good spirits. Well, well, today's a big day. Today's a great day because guess what? We are headed to pick up the Black Mamba. Before we get started, I want to say huge news, epic news. We have a brand new website. That's right. It's called mambamerch.com. Very creative. Very creative. I said a very long, nice thing of a great name. But on this website, you're going to have uh, the I Love Haters hats, uh, the Stang Mode hoodies, a bunch of stuff. Basically, we moved away from Teespring because a lot of you hit me up that the quality wasn't as good as you were hoping and the shipping times were too long. So we invested, we, we partnered with a company, we have our own website, our own merchandise that will come to you quickly. And we won't just also do just things like hats and shirts and hoodies. We're gonna have things like tire pressure gauges, license plate frames, uh, key tags, key chains, posters, stickers, all that kind of good stuff. And what's happening here with the white mama? What do we have in front of her? That's right. What? That's right, we have a 2003 to 04 Cobra front bumper that's going on. We're gonna take it to Casper's. We have bought rims for it that are waiting to come in. I'm gonna do some fun stuff with this build. Super excited. But without further ado, let's go load this up, head to Casper's and grab the Black Mamba. And uh, we're gonna take her out, drive her, and we're gonna talk about our two year review. What Casper's has done to the car is a few things to get it ready for this long road trip to Florida that we gotta drive 15 hours. They've put in a 315 pumpkin in because we got it ready for boost. They've also added back the exhaust. No more dumps because we want to have a quiet ride. But again, if you don't know, I said it is V-banded so we can take those off when we want to drop some weight. She's ready to go. I'm excited. Let's have a chit chat. Two years has come and gone fast. Let's see how it feels. We are back in the Black Mamba. Immediately, you'll notice is, since Casper's put on the uh, regular exhaust back on, uh, don't more dumps, it's a lot more quiet. We also have the 315 gears back in. It's a lot, the, the whine is a little bit gone from the, the rear diff because those other 355 gears we beat up on, this, on the drag strip. But let's talk about how this car in the last two years has basically changed my life and turned it upside down. It kind of like, before we go into some of the ownership experience and uh, reviews of the car as a whole, what were the milestones with this car that really put it on the map and made the channel successful and grow and how we got here? At the time I was EcoBeast, had about a little over 3,000 subscribers, hit me up, said, listen, my name's Jesus, I'm at a dealership, uh, I, I, I know that uh, you're looking at one, we have one and you wanna go check it out. Well, we got it, thanks to Jesus for hooking me up. I'm tired, but I'm anxious to drive this beautiful V8 performance pack Mustang GT home, and I'm going to start it up for the first time for you. But there it is. We were the, one of the first, I believe, on YouTube with the 2018 Mustang GT. I knew there was others out there, but we were one of the first that was able to do some content. Went to the drag strip, uh, ran a crazy time. I think it was a 12-1 on stock tires. Eventually got 11-8. Yo, 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 12, one at 119. At a completely bone stock 2018 on stock tires. That's right, 12, one at 119, 1960 foot. Here it Sorry is. Sorry for you LS fanboys. Uh-oh, <laughs> uh-oh. <laughs> Rob Schumacher hit me up at the time he was Jersey. This is where things really started to change. This is when things started to go nuts. And this is where the Black Mamba came. <laughs> Eleven three. 
My hands are shaking. 11-3 at 123. I knew it was hot. Yo, 1760. Let's, let's go. My pants about to fall down. Let's go. 11-3, baby. Yo, congrats. Yo, thank you. Thank you. Ah, bam. Yo, Tune, Rob Shoemaker, E85, Nitto NTO5Rs, 1760, 11 3. 23. Seven, you took off hard. And guess what? There's more in. There's more in this. Ah! The Black Mamba. Ah, we know we're going for tents. We going for tents, baby. I ran full interior, by the way. All I had full interior, E85 jail to intake. I had some. I had. I had a Steeda Stop Hot Level One. But I was screaming for joy, and I'm a big basketball fan. And I said, the Black Mamba, you know, does it. And I was dancing and all that kind of stuff. And then the name kind of stuck. So that was the Black Mamba lure and we had the chance where we uh got to to beat mod to fame's cheapo kitty and, and the fact that the na mustang beat the 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 grand hellcat was a big deal and the myth the legend uh, no you myth, know? no legend listen this guy showed up with drag radios and e85 in his back seat i don't want to hear that <laughs> underdog bullshit <laughs> i uh i just know this guy has a hellcat and he has a, a twin turbo Porsche right there. So, I mean, I, I, if I'm not an underdog, okay. But I'm gonna walk you like a fucking. Oh! Freak, right? Got a chance where I raced James Seed, which is an automatic Hellcat, and we beat him. Uh, he ran better time, but we beat him uh, to the end of the strip, so we got the win there. We he got a chance to meet up with Street Speed, and uh, he had the new, at the time last year in 2018, the, the, the new Corvette ZR1, right? Let's do it. Ready? Yeah, I'm. Got him, baby. We got him. We beat Street Speed with the 10 speed Black Mamba. Let's go. I'm on the full sauce E85. Let's go. 10 speed. Yeah, I had to get. We beat a lot of cars that shouldn't we shouldn't have beaten uh, by virtue of the 10 speed automatic, and we went from there. We started flying. Then what happened after that was we got invites from Ford to do uh, reviews. I did my first ever uh, review with a Ford uh, media car was the performance pack level two. This message finds you all well and in good spirits. We are here. We are going to be going to the racetrack to 
drive the 2018-2019 Mustang GT Performance Pack Level 2. I did take the Black Mamba up here and she did well. There she is. A lot of bugs on the grill. All right, so we are here at, I uh, hope I'm saying this right, Monticello. And I was in so much, you know, uh, out of body experiences like this and before I was I'm and I still am I consider myself a regular car Mustang guy and these uh, this this 2018 Mustang it afforded me these opportunities to hang out with larger youtubers we won some races with them the car is performing phenomenally now we're getting advice from Ford so as you can tell like it's it, it's almost surreal that this black Mustang is gaining so much traction and so Things just started to snowball from there and we were able to do more events, go more places. We started to get more subscribers. We started to earn more income. And now we're here, two years later. It's a journey that I never expected. It's a journey that I'll never, I'll never, I'll never take for granted. These are opportunities I never thought would happen. And I had just explained my journey with the EcoBeast, the, the 2015 EcoBoost. And I got a lot of, you know, that's why I wear the hat. Uh, I love haters. I got a lot of hater, a lot of hate for it, but um, it motivated me. The Black Mamba really helped create this whole brand that I had no idea about. Getting to beat Hellcats and Corvettes and getting Ford to invite me to these places and of course doing my daily videos on news and, and my mods and all that kind of stuff. And now we're on this precipice of finally getting the car boosted by B BMP, one of the most famous uh, supercharging companies for a Mustang. Um, you know, it's just a testament to, you know, you don't know what God's plan is for you and this is what the plan is right now and we're pursuing it. And the most, what I take out of this whole thing is I really appreciate all the people I've met along the way, all the relationships I've built, all the different um, communities I've been able to become a part of that I would have never had without this car, without this um, this channel. Uh, so I'm just humbled every day by it, and I'm I'm almost in awe that we're here. But you know, you never know. And, and yes, I'm not a million subscribers or 200 or half a million, whatever. But I do really appreciate, I mean, just to give you some perspective, I did a video celebrating 50 subscribers. That's the story about how this car kind of changed my life. So we just stopped by here to uh, give the Mamba a bath before her road trip to uh, Florida, but uh, just to talk about some things, if you're in the market for a 2018 and up, uh, I can't guarantee you might have the same experience or luck I have, but I tell you, it's a great car. You're gonna really enjoy it. Um, it's only critique was a lot of people had a problem with the quote unquote tick. Uh, I did not, uh, my motor's been fine, and my only recipe to avoid the noise or make it sound smoother was to do 10 and a half quarts of 5W30 with Royal Purple, and we used two bottles of Ceratec oil additive and she's been purring ever since uh, and she's been fine. Um, also, what I would recommend is if you're gonna get stick shift, be careful because I think there's some issues with people who who had problems with the shift forks because they broke on them. Uh, not for me, I had the 10-speed automatic and everything's been stout ever since. Um, so really a fan. Uh, big shout out, if you guys do know, we've changed the color multiple times. We had the beautiful purple and then the green uh, custom coatings did all the work. We had the car at the Philly, uh, Philly Auto Show, America, uh, America Muscle Show, and we're gonna probably change it again because we can't make up our mind. But black is probably everyone's favorite. And uh, just to go over the walk around the mods that you see, we have Anderson Composites, obviously, uh, carbon fiber hood, uh, grill, lower splitter, trunk. Uh, we do have uh, the performance pack wheels from the EcoBoost. <laughs> we got rid of our PB1s, we sold them for mods. Mustang guys who mod know the whole game of buying and selling and trading your parts a lot. Um, but they're just for daily purposes. Do have the extended lugs. We do have the bare br drag brakes on here. You can't see it, but we have a complete Steeda drag suspension. And the car has uh, the JLT colder intake, the Texas Speed Catalyst headers, which I will say, and I'm doing my opinion, you don't really need uh, Catalyst headers. I mean, the headache, and the and the the cost is unless you're totally drag racing, I don't think it's that necessary. But um, everything else is ship shape. I uh, want to thank all people who support. Casper has always done a great job fixing the car for me. Again, shoe, Rob Shoemaker tuned the car, and uh, just had a phenomenal experience. I think you're not going to be sorry that you got a 2018. Well, 
Hope you enjoy any questions, comment below. I'll keep continuing this journey. We'll dialogue it because you guys know it never ends. Peace. Good old E85 starts in the cold. driving into Easter Bib, I can't keep up. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta I gotta run. Oh my god. Wow. Oh my god. This looks amazing. It looks blue, purple, black. Ah. 10.84, nice. That's the same okay, so you can see here, Mamba went 10.9, 10.8, and a 10.8 again. So this was the best pass ever for Mamba. Funny thing is, he went a 1560 here and a 156. I'm actually leaving with less power than here. I was leaving at 4,000. Here we're leaving at about 3,500. So <clears throat> I think um, the only reason I didn't stay later is because I have so much going on the next day. Uh, so with getting the garage set up, doing all that stuff, I could have stayed later. Probably would have cracked if I could. Probably would have stayed a little bit later. Got maybe a 1079, but. Uh, in any event, really happy with the performance right now. We're we're well consistently now a 10 second car. So. <laughs>